Welcome back to another episode of The Whole Story. I am Ben Garwood from the Business Change Team and I'm also here with PO Paul Chandler. What are we covering today? Episode 16, wow. Um, today we are going to look at the activities section of Street Manager with a particular emphasis on um, section 58, which we're getting a uh, couple of inquiries about from people. Uh, so without further ado, Ben, let's log in. Okay, so we're logged in here as a highway authority. And if you can scroll down to the bottom, you'll see add activity to map. So let's go ahead and choose that. Go ahead, Ben. What street do you want to choose? I'm going to go for Oxford Street. Fine choice, fine choice. And if you can drop the pin for me, sir. Lovely old job, just like raising a permit. So if you scroll to the bottom and continue, why don't you draw me a nice polygon, Ben? So polygon and draw. And here we are causing some ruckus in um, Oxford Street, one of the busiest streets in England. And don't forget when you're drawing that polygon on the fourth point, you need to double tap just to make sure that, that polygon is complete. Top tip, Ben. Guess you learned that the hard way doing a live webinar or something. Yes, I did. Um, if you can choose um, event, why not? Why not? And give it a um, number at the top there, please. Or a name, whatever you like. Yeah, good stuff. So now, um, we won't bother, but you could give it a contact organisation. So it could be the organiser of the event, or it could be someone within your within your organisation who knows about the event. We'll leave that up to you. Again, some contact details. Give us a start date of this event, Ben. Put it in for like a week's time or whatever. And it's just um, going to go on for two days, say, so the 31st to the 1st, lovely stuff. And the activity location can be the, uh, well, I think it was the footway where you drew that beautiful polygon. And ju just say shop opening or something, you know. I mean, traditionally that would be two words, <laughs> but that's fine. Um, and uh, there would just be uh, no carriageway incursion, I would dare to suggest there. And if you scroll down, no collaborative working, sadly. Don't have to add any additional information, and we'll continue. Here is our review page, so you can uh, see what you've put in. So in this case, what we're doing is a um, uh, event but we could have done this as a section 58, um, but it works in the same way. So you are saying, here is our area that we're resurfacing. You could draw a lovely big polygon over a big length of road. Um, you could use the additional details to record the length of your restriction. Uh, you could also, if you scroll down, Ben, you could use the, the start and end date of the um, event to record the, the dates of the section 58. Uh, we already have stakeholders using Street Manager for this. Um, the only thing it doesn't, uh, go ahead and add, add the activity, Ben. The only thing it doesn't do uh, for us is give that advance notification of um, the section 58. So we need to introduce some functionality in Street Manager down the line to give that three months notice. Um, but we can go to other electronic means of communication uh, while we get that sorted out. Um, so now, Ben, what we're going to do is if you return to the home page, the other thing you can do, if you go into view map for me um, and you um, search for that job in Street Manager, Oxford Street, Westminster, dare I suggest, that might be useful for you. Lovely old job. Go and find that um, event. There it is. If you click on it, view event details, you've got a couple of options there at the bottom. Change activity details, cancel activity. So if you, if you go into change activity details, Ben, and whilst I'm talking, if you add an extra day onto the event or something. So 
I know this is a little bit clunky, guys, to have to go and find the job in the map. There's nowhere to search for it at the moment if you want to make a change to it. We, we had a difficult choice between having um, a list page for the events and being able to uh, update them um, or did we just want to have the ability to update the event without the list page and we went backwards and forwards and debated that and for MVP for April we decided just to go with the ability to be able to change these events because it saves cancelling and having to raise a whole new one. Uh, but in the near future, as the early months of April, May, June come in, we can easily add that list page into Street Manager um, and then add filtering onto that list page and all sorts of good things. So you also saw there we had the option to um, cancel it. That works in the same way as changing it, really. So you can raise these activities in Street Manager on the map as the... Um, highway authority and I think everyone is going to get a lot of benefit out of that promoters being able to see um, what uh, activities are on the network in a way that's not so easy at the moment and highway authorities being able to uh, effectively manage their networks by having uh, a lot of different types of activity in one place. Thank you everybody for watching this episode, episode 16 of The Whole Story. Uh, keep your eye out for more episodes coming soon. Thank you.